Like, are we, is this plane just like, all right, cool. Open, open, oh. Something tells me my controller is uh, not working. Hello everyone and welcome back to the channel. My name is Adam, this is HMO4Gaming. Welcome you back to GTA San Andreas. In the last episode, we completed our casino heist and we broke the bank at the Caligula's Casino and we're $100,000 more richer for it. We pissed off the Mafia, but they don't do anything to CJ because they ain't shit. In this episode, we're going to be continuing the main story and announcing our return to Los Santos. And I think we also have to help the U.S. government steal some things for Torino, and we'll be getting into that in time. If you're excited for that, please hit like, hit subscribe, do all those things on down below, and let's get this party started. Cause he's packing a six shooter. Oh, next. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Do you know how much balls it takes to stand down here and sing a song like that? It takes guts. I'm, I'm sorry. We're just looking for something with a little more uh, mass appeal. What could have more mass appeal than a song like Small but Perfectly Formed? Women want me. Men want to be like me. Assholes. Oh. <laughs> Gotta be right. kidding me, right? Damn. This casino game is hard work. I thought it was just a case of opening the doors and letting suckers give you their money. If only. You know what? I'm getting bored here. I'm trying to do business, not audition midgets. People of reduced stature, you mean? Yeah, yeah, I said that. All I know is when are we gonna get some real talent in here? I heard that. Mad dog. CJ, clean, dude. That's good news, man. Hey, what's cracking? You ready to take it to the stage again? Easy, CJ. Come on, man. One step at a time, you know? I'm almost ready, but, but. But what? I want to go home now, CJ. That's cool, man. I'll take you. Where's home? My mansion, baby. Yeah, I heard about that place. Drugs, sex, all that shit. <laughs> yeah, you know it. Yeah, but... yeah, I've been there. I, I mean, I've seen it on TV. Yeah. Nice crib. Thanks, player. We could do with a place like that to set up in the LS again. Wait for sweet. Mmm. Get things moving. Get out this midget game. But CJ, come on, man. What? I saved your life, man. My mansion ain't big enough. Only got 19 bedrooms, you heard? All right, man. My mansion's been seized. IRS? Nah, not exactly. Who? Nobody. Who, man, dog? All right, Big Papa. Big Papa? The drug dealer? Man, you got your multi-million dollar mansion to a motherfucking pusher? You know, CJ, these things happen. I was powerless. You fucking degenerate? Oh. Man, how much blow can one guy snort? It's not my fault, CJ. Man, I should have let you jump. Come with me, all of you. We all going home. Well, do it. Let's go get his mansion back from the drug dealers. A lot of shooting to get Mad Dog's mansion back. Hello? Hey, what's up, Carl? Hey, Kendall, what's up? How do I have cell reception all the way up here? We're gonna drive back to uh, San Fierro first. Want to check things out there before we hook up with you guys in Los Santos. All right, cool. You be careful. I'll be fine. I got Caesar and Mad Dog to keep me safe. You be careful. Oh, I will. I'll see you in Los Santos. I'll be careful by jumping out of a plane. Me and you gonna go in to clear the place out. Good idea. The element of surprise. So the rest of the crew can move in in peace. I also think I might have overestimated this because I probably should have stopped at ammunition to uh, stock up, but eh, we're going to be living on the edge. Also, it'll look pretty good. Except for the shimmering of the um, things keeping the Vinewood side in place, but you know. Alright. So, they're going to land on the roof, get messed up, and uh, we're going to be the second wave to clean up their mess. 
Which you think, you know, highly trained like Triad who are able to uh, jump down and secure the position, do all this crazy stuff, should be able to take out some random gangbangers, but whatever. Right? We, and then we can't hold the position. They get their asses kicked. Whoever jumped before? Nah, you? Nah. When we land, Ooh, it looks like we're not even invincible. moving. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. They're invincible, but I think it's just hilarious how we're not even moving. Like, are we... Is this plane just, like... Alright. Cool. Open. Open! Open! Oh. Something tells me my controller is uh, not working. All right, let's try this again. And fun fact, as it was trying to reload, I experienced my first crash of my entire time recording this series. Um, I guess that's pretty good after 25, 30 hours. I uh, only had one crash after that time. But that means now that we're in the end game, that means uh, maybe they haven't really uh, play tested the end game on the Switch and see how stable it is. Oh boy, we're going to be into hopefully a non-glitchy mess as we head into the final end game. As we descend, I could just cut this out, but have little updates about the game itself. So I was planning on doing some live stream. I still am planning, but don't know when I'm going to get to it. Um, a bunch of the asset missions, such as trucking, the quarry. Fun fact, there is an asset mission for the actual trains in this game, which I never knew about. So... I think for the sake of the series, we're going to, you know, push on to the end game, beat the game itself, and then maybe in future do all those other things as an extra bonus mission. Don't know. I just want to get some other series on the way so I can continue some content for you guys. All right. And now that we're landing, PSA over, let's take out some drug dealers. <laughs> as we do. Why am I shooting at that car? I think I was shooting at a cop. Instead of the friggin' uh, drug dealers. Hilarious. Also, you guys better not have armor. Seeing as though you're not even wearing a shirt. Look at this. Are you kidding me? Who the hell shirt? You guys aren't even wearing shirts. Alright, and we're just basically making our way over here to the door. I think. Yeah, this is where we need to go. Do I literally have to still survive waves of stuff? That's ridiculous. Oh, well, I guess I can just shoot them here. Get back to the roof. Nah, I'm good. I'm just gonna shoot these guys. Oh, are they just stuck in their animation? Because they're just supposed to go to the roof? <laughs> Try to arrive, get to the roof and collect them. Alright, well, come on, dudes. I already took out all these dudes. Where are you guys coming from? Alright, come on, dudes. Alright, dudes, what are we doing? Come on. Now we can go into the mansion. Just jump. And head on in. We're heavily outnumbered, but if we all I saw those guys hanging in there. Ass. Oh no, I, I like that guy. Oh, yeah, shoot those guys. So sorry. Also, I don't understand why these gang members are like Acting like they're a military operation that have all this DJ, weapon and corridor. armor we'll and shit. Oh, like, these guys shouldn't be this organized and this able to take out basically triads. These are just gangbangers. Oh, that might have been Denise. Oh, she had it coming to her, seeing as though she's uh, over here in a crack den. <laughs> Imagine if that was her. Now I know there's armor in here somewhere. Yo, how about these double beds and these big papas downstairs? I hope so. Clear out all these freaking ones. Hey, asking you shall see. This is uh, my home. This is my base of operation, that's why. Where's this big poppy at? Big, uh, Mad Dog's Mansion looks freaking cool if you come from this way. You know, we only see a little bit of it. Uh, 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 
god. Oh god, I'm shooting Denise again. Alright. Is there any health back here? No. There's a movie. Look at this library. Mad Dog's got a nice ass mansion. Who the hell are you shooting at? I don't even think I ever looked to see in the kitchen here anymore. Look at this place. Yeah, I don't think I've ever explored this place as a kid. Look at this friggin' uh, kitchen. This is friggin' beautiful. No wonder why we want to take this place back. All right, where is you this? Chose the wrong to rob, fool. Oh, you want Dude, I must have killed like half a dozen of your homies already. <laughs> so you can't really kill him. He's immune. You have to do the whole chase scene. <gasps> I'll keep killing all these Denises. Yeah, we can't really kill him. Not yet. We have to do a whole chase scene. And crazy interior places that I can't just run You don't know through. who you're fucking with, do you? Mm, you don't either, dude. All you fools are gonna die! I mean, I kind of killed all your you squad. You're trying to fuck with my, with my shit! What's poppin' next? Oh, sorry. You think I'm a bitch, Why huh? there's heat-seeking goggles right here is beyond me. Excuse me, people. Please, no, Get out of my way. Bro, watch out. Anybody in the gym? No, no one's in the gym. <laughs> I like how you can have time to just go and uh, work out and shit. Yeah, so he's basically going to be heading down to his car. And we're going to have to do you. an epic chase scene as I kill all of his homies. All right. That should, that should be about it. Yeah, Big Pop should let the mansion follow him. Yeah, basically. Run to his hot rod, but then uh, there's a car right next to it. I wonder if it's still pink in this game. Yep, it is. <laughs> I always remember that. You chase after him in this little pink mobile. Which is just your standard chase scene now. Why in this little pink bird? I have no idea. I guess maybe it might be his girlfriend's car or something. I don't know. At least they didn't give me the option to shoot at him first so I can uh, shoot out his tires and make him swerve all over the road like Pulaski. That would have been hilarious. Or, I mean, his AI is terrible. I wouldn't be surprised if he, like, flies off the road. He's not really going too fast. Hopefully I can just shoot him a little bit. Yep. Hey, Brit. Shoot, please. I don't understand why the look of oh, little going into the freaking ground. Come on. This car is literally just melting into the ground. Ooh, shit! <gasps> oh, come on. Like, why did, 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 Come you please come leave yourself on. alone? Come on. Here? Come on. Oh, fuck. Oh, you mate, mongrel. Oh, sorry. You shouldn't be choking the gecko in the first place. Remember what happened to that gig in That's my dog. That groupie loved it. That wasn't a groupie. That was a roadie. But she had great tits. Man tits. They were man tits. Hey, what happened? Hey, what the sound's that? I don't know, bruv. It all just went. 
You fucking shite, you RP. I can't be held responsible for dodgy gear, all right? Come on, keep it together, man. You can't fuck with us, Flo. Finally, I thought I'd never get through to you. What the? What's Torino, this? is that you? What's happening here? Torino? Listen, you gotta pull one last trick. Hold up, mate. Look, okay? hold up one second. Communists at the gate, Carl. I'm tired of this, Torino. I'm outside. Let's take a ride. No, I'm eating things. Fuck me. Oh, I'm hey, I gotta on. get out of here. You got this? Hey, dog, I gotta go hit a marketing meeting. I'm gonna catch you later. All right, Monet, go, sunshine. Yeah, sweet ass. Come on, you having that, Mac? You having that? I'm a die in the eye of the storm. That's my death. Well, no invite to the housewarming, huh, kid? I knew you'd come anyway. Yeah, well, that's not important right now. I'll bring you up to speed on the way. Get in. He has my phone number, so I don't know why he had to make such, like, a flashy entrance, but whatever. How long is this gonna take? I got my own shit to worry about. Would you like to see your brother this week? Yeah, what can I do? You just gotta steal a military jet off an amphibious assault ship and use it to destroy a piece of the spy ship. Nothing big. Oh man, you shit. When I shit you, Carl, there's a boat. All the gear you'll need is on board. I'll keep you briefed as you go. I ain't coming back from this one, am I? Yes, you are. Don't be ridiculous. Here, take this earpiece. Trust me, do as I say. You'll be home for a blowjob and a bologna sandwich. A blowjob and a bologna sandwich. It's like he knows Carl. Alright. What the hell? What the hell was that? It sounded like a boat crashed into something somewhere. As happens in this game. The ship is moored in the Easter Basin Naval Bay. Yeah, so essentially we're gonna sneak in the back of the uh, airship assault carrier, shoot our way through some unsuspecting weekend soldiers, and steal a Hydra. And then Trina wants us to blow some um, boats Stay up with the, the Hydra. Being seen. Once you're on the inside, I cannot help you. Well, can you help me now? Uh, well, no. Actually, no. <laughs> so, you could go in all quiet-like and all that, but, you know, I mean, either way, you're gonna have to uh, do some things inside. So I'm going to try my best at being uh, super quiet. Definitely want to turn those SAM turrets off so we don't get blown up out of the sky. There's our bird. So we need to get that. Try not to alert the guards. Yeah, because they have a bunch of M16s and body armor, which is annoying. Which, <laughs> which <laughs> you don't even get a chance to be quiet. Literally in this version, for whatever reason, they just do that. Which is hilarious because, you know, ooh, they're squishy. Alright, I don't know why they pick this mission to be super squishy and not others, but whatever. Oh, that's just a little guard dude. Yeah, don't shoot him. He's just doing his job. Alright, so we're going to be making our way through the aircraft carrier. I'm very surprised that those dudes were super squishy. I was expecting them just to be like the last two missions. Everyone's all freaking armored out and whatnot. So watch out, because they do have M16s, and they can melt us. Um, we could just take off and go, but, you know, I don't think I've ever shown, or, well, I'll say shown, but I don't think I've ever turned this off. <laughs> We're just going to make it as easy as possible, so let's just turn those off. There we go. So I probably should have done that when we stole the jetpack in Black Project. Probably would have made it a lot easier, but, you know. Oh, hello, dude. Dude, I just shot your foot and you died. Alright, well that's cool. Alright, and there's our jet. We don't really... I think you can get it to raise the platform, or as soon as you go in it raises the platform, but you really don't need to. You don't really need to worry about that. So here's our jet, and let's get out of here. Come on. Let's go, ZJ. Ooh, shit. <laughs> Alright, let's go in the jet mode. And Torino essentially just wants us to blow up these boats. The funny thing is, if I had a minigun, we could just land and do this easily, but eh, we're gonna do it the cool way. You're not a British tank, you'd be fine. Alright. And it auto locks on, which is nice. 
unlike uh, in like the other version where you have to lock on yourself. Makes it pretty cool though. Uh, countermeasures. Gotta watch out, the military don't like us. As they would, I just stole a piece of military tech, so you know. Lock on, please. There you go. Yeah. It is one of the cooler missions. Again, it is one of those iconic missions, just like the Casino Heist. I thought it was always pretty cool. Like I said, back in the day, when I was a kid, I didn't know that you could uh, uh, turn the jet into jet mode to go super fast. So I was always like, why can't I go forward? Why am I always hovering? Let's take out these other dudes. Let's dogfight. That'd be cool. Carl's over here. I'm an international agent. I'm just taking all these guys out. Look at Carl over here. I feel like I'm playing Rogue Squadron. Yo, if they remaster Rogue Squadron and put that on the Switch, oh, you best better believe we're going to be playing that. I love the Star Wars Rogue Squadron series. This is what this is feeling like right now. Did I blow them up? Look at Carl over here. I think I took out all the jets, so we should be fine. And there we go. I think that's the last one. Fuck you, Torino! I never want to go through this again! I think I'm an Earl! Oh, what a big wine. You want some cheese with that wine? Hey, you were spectacular. You know what? I'm beginning to think my little Carl's a double agent. Shut up, Torino! What do you want this thing? Ooh. What thing? I don't know what you're talking about. You stole it. Got nothing to do with me. I don't know what you're talking about. See you around. Torino! Torino! Shit! Alright. Then we're just gonna land on the airstrip. And get out. Get out, CJ. There we go. Do I really have to go land it over there? Come on. Let's go. Come on. Annoying. Oh, I have to actually take it into the garage? Oh, look at CJ being a cool. He's like, this is my Hydra now. <laughs> and there we go. 50k. The Hydra will now be available in this hangar. Which, I really wish we could do the vigilante stuff with it, but, you know. Alright. And I think with that, we have time for one last mission. Um, like Torino said, he's gonna help us get our brother back so let's head back to the mansion and see what uh he has to offer as i blow myself up <laughs> i don't care how i care when as in now you hear me hey man what the f hello boss man taking care of business i see Torino, fuck you. Almost lost my life out there for you. I got just one tiny little thing for you to do, and then I'm out of your life forever. You know what? I'm tired of your fucking little job. Ah, will you stop? This is pathetic. Come on, you're embarrassing yourself. Come on, put it down. Don't be ridiculous, okay? Hey, I got a little surprise for you here. You ready for this? Huh? Answer it. Hello? Carl, sweet, sweet. Oh, sweet. I don't know what happened. They just released me. No idea what's going on. But I'm in the square outside the precinct in commerce. All right, you hold tight. I'll be right there. All right. So what was that little job you was talking about, Torino? I just want you to go pick up your brother. Get out of here. See, Torino has a heart after all. So we're going to head down to the police station and pick up Sweet and take him home. What's up, bro? Hey, what's up, man? How you doing, bro? I'm all right, man. Hey, man, we off to our new spot. We got a mansion, Sweet. We've been putting in work, and shit is going well. We got a stake in the casino. We got some insane shit in Fierro. We getting into the rap game. Hey, man. Let me get you some new clothes, come on. New clothes? Nigga, what the fuck is this bullshit? What you mean, man? What's mine is yours, and you know that. You never did get it, did you, Carl? I need to go check on things in the hood. Man, that's the problem. You always a perpetrator, running from what's real. Hey, man, shit's fucked up there. You don't want to be in the hood. No, that's exactly where I want to be. What you done for our hood? 
Man, what the hood done for me? Always dragging me down. Ever since I got out the hood, shit been cracked. That's everybody dream to get out the hood. Man, you sound just like smoke right now. All right, man. You hard. I'm gonna show you what's going on in the hood. You gotta understand, shit's all fucked up now, dude. Yeah? What you want, it ain't around here no more. Just take me to Mama's house. Which, you know, I understand where Sweet coming from. I mean, obviously when he went in, he was still gangbanging, and then we went on our whole hero's journey. But it's like, oh, you sound like smoke right now. It's like, why? CJ's not dealing drugs. He's um, doing stuff with cars in a garage. He's, you know, a partner with um, the triad in the casino. Um, he just made a ton of money off of robbing a casino. So I don't understand what the problem is. Like, oh, I gotta check on things with the hood. I was like, okay, we can do that. But, you know, there's more to life than just sitting back and shooting people because of uh, coming over to the hood. Like, you know, gangbang. I mean, you could take over the entire city. It doesn't really do anything. But all right, here we are, sweet. I'll show you. Hey, yo, 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 what, yo, what about this blender? It, it's really <laughs> good. It, it's, it sort of works. Man, what the fuck? That's Mom's blender. Look like base heads who took over the spot. Let's go home. This is home, man. Get these fuckers out of mom's house. You was born in there. Damn. And still, I wish you can upgrade it. Kill the crack dealers in your hood to keep your gang healthy. If a gang member is high in crack, you won't be able to use them. We don't need any help. We can take all these dudes out anyway. I sure am craving some Mr. Whoopi. <laughs> Right. Don't know why the frig these guys have so much health. And why they, uh. Yeah, screw you. Oh shit. Yeah, screw you guys. You survived the first wave, I'll say. This it? There we go, at least sweets oh, help yeah, us. Should have stayed at home. And there's a second wave. Might hey, as well take out the now. rest of these drug dealers and take up all their money. I'll take back the hood. All right, well, if you could help me out. I like how it's like, oh, it's start, start a gang war. I've already done that. I guess you don't have to start the gang war. You could take out the dudes first. So it's like, whatever. Let me grab this health and body armor first. Oh, come on. All right, man, let's get out of here and go see Ken. Kendall can come see me right here at her home. But it ain't nothing here no more. Rome wasn't built in a day, nigga. My brother could be a real pain in the ass. True. And with that, the gang wars are back on. We've taken back Grove Street from the ballers, and now you have the option to spread out and take the whole hood back, holding a not-so-friend anymore person. So, I think in the next episode... What, buddy? You lost? Yeah, we can... <laughs> he was lost. Alright. So, with that, that baller taken out of the way, I think uh, we're going to wrap up with today's episode. In the next episode, we're going to see what Sweet's got, and we still have another mission up at the home in the hills um, to see Kendall, and I hope you join me for that as we hit towards the climactic, epic conclusion of GTA San Andreas here on the Switch. But until next time... I have been Adam, this has been HMO4 Gaming, and this has been GTA San Andreas here on the Switch. Thank you very much. Have yourselves a great day.